Hello and welcome to the CSCart video tutorial. My name is Alex and today we're going to speak about email settings. Let's begin! Before messing with email settings, we need to check a couple of things. First, we visit the administrator list and check whether all administrator emails are true and correct. Then we go to Settings Company and check if all departments have their own correct emails. By the way, you can use more than one email for each department. Just use commas to divide email addresses from each other. Finally, we can move to Email Settings. Method of sending emails – that's the main setting. Others are supplementary and are used only when one of the methods is chosen. But first things first. Three methods are available – via an external SMTP server, via the PHP mail function and via send mail program. We recommend to use the default PHP mail function method. This method is already set up and ready for work, so we advise you to use it for sending emails. In most cases, the send mail program is ready to be used, but if you need to configure it, specify the path to the program's executable file in this field. Now let's set up the SMTP server method. It's just an example. Double check your connection details before specifying them. First, we enter the SMTP host name. If you use Gmail, it's gotta be something like this smtp.gmail.com, colon, and a number for port 465. Second, we specify the SMTP username. In most cases, this is your Gmail address. Third, make up a password for your SMTP server. Fourth, use encrypted connection. The SMTP server requires SSL connection. And the last one is SMTP authentication. Tick the checkbox. Now let's try to make it work. To demonstrate this method, we simply change the status of an order and see what happens. We can see the error that the message could not be sent. This has possibly happened due to SSL settings. So check them on your server before using this method. Well, that's it about email settings. If you have any questions, you can ask them in the comments section below. Thanks for watching and see you in the next CISCART video tutorials.